they worried about me they worried about this retention appointment after my surgery i could care less about that i went on surgery for botox and bladder installments installations whatever and of course i get you won't see results until like a few of them but like not even a tiny bit of a results and they worried about this retention i gotta find a new job i got fired from a temporary job at walmart um getting this surgery until i get back into my field as a teacher assistant which i'm gonna try hard to because it's an uppity side of town and i made a mistake at the last but anyways like I, i'm literally on the phone i gotta go to the bathroom now i hold it for a little bit at this point like you just gonna have to wait a little bit like i went before i left home and be having to go again and like I said, if you know anybody who deal with this, don't take no bladder pills because this gonna make it worse. My bladder was 30, like I went every 25 to 30, 35 minutes before bladder pills. After that, taking four different bladder pills, I start going every 10 minutes. Every 10, I never make it to 15 minutes. And they wanna, I'm trying to schedule the next Botox for August every three months. And she up here worried about this retention, sir, um, retention appointment. Like, I don't care. I don't have time for that. I got bills and rent to pay. pay. I got to find a new job. The job part is the easy part. I don't have time wasting gas to go up there. I don't have time. And she literally won't make this appointment. Thinking, like, I got some schedule to fit in during these interviews to go there. And it's far. I don't even have insurance. I, I've been so stressed out. Look at this. Like, and it's almost that time of the month, but it's never that bad. And I got, I needed like acne patches like for two days now. I just haven't been caring, but I'm definitely going to get some. But anyway, it's God bless.